Hey, I'm here with my uh, really cool Leslie cab that I love. It sounds awesome. Um, I like it on the slow speed. It's on the. It does, you know, the fast too, but the slow speed. The fastest too, blah, 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 blah. Uh, but anyway, uh, I don't think it's loud enough, so I'm going to swap out the speaker. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear the kind of swirling. Um, I know I can, like totally sitting here. Um, but uh, no sound at all comes out of the front. This is purely just decorative. Um, it's all out the side. And all it is is like little, like three inch or so um, slots that run from about here to here. And then like here to here on the top and then about here to here on the side too. Um, so they're just little rectangular slots that the sound comes out of. Uh, so anyway, the speaker that's in it is a Jensen Mod series, and I really like it. Uh, my speakers right there that I built in another video, so check that out, subscribe, do all that stuff. Um, I really like the Jensen series mod, uh, the Jensen Mod series pickups uh, speakers. My goodness, it's been a long day stuck inside with uh, you know the whole coronavirus thing out in the world uh, but anyway uh, it's been a long day it's been a long five months uh, so anyway I'm gonna swap out the speaker uh, this has a uh, little 8 inch uh, mod 820 so it's a 20 watt 8 inch uh, little speaker and it's 4 ohms so I have it with my uh, silver jubilee running at 4 ohms into this and uh, what I'd like to do is be able to run it, this speaker, in conjunction with other cabinets. So what I'm going to do is um, swap this out for a uh, fairly old vintage Celestion G12K85. Uh, and it's Celestion International Limited, Ipswich, England. It's one of the old ones. Uh, made in England and it's 16 ohms so then I can run in and a 12 inch so obviously it's going to be uh, a whole lot louder uh, I can run this cabinet the Leslie cabinet with a different head and run my Silver Jubilee through the two speakers that I have there that uh, I really like so I'll just you know run it through two amps but uh, the other amp that I have, a uh, Marshall DSL, does not allow a 4 ohm uh, output speaker. Uh, but I like to mess around with the, uh, the little... Can you hear the swirly? Anyway, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to play this um, for a minute and then stop the video, swap out the speaker. You guys don't need to see me swap a speaker. I'm going to do it all without moving anything, without touching anything, not even retuning my guitar, nothing. Then I'll play it with the um, new selection speaker in it and we'll kind of see how it seems. Okay, not even touching the amp or anything. So I'm just going to play this for a minute. Okay. I just put the uh, Celestian speaker in and flip the uh, amp back on so I haven't tried it yet I'm gonna see uh, how it sounds <laughs> It sounds a little bit louder, 
Uh, my son is here helping with the camera. A um, little bit louder? Yeah. Seems a little bit louder. Um, obviously, one single speaker with uh, just, you know, a 20 watt amp, um, not totally cranked. Obviously, it's not going to be like, whoa, that's so insanely louder. It's just one speaker. Uh, it may be a little more efficient, whatever, um, so it may be a little bit louder. Um, it's definitely a bigger speaker, maybe a little bit louder, um, but not, as I kind of suspected, not a gigantic difference. Uh, but it sounds a little clearer, a little cleaner. Uh, I think it might sound okay with um, the two amp in the speaker kind of situation. Uh, I think that might work out all right slightly cleaner um, just to kind of fill in some of the frequencies that you know maybe I don't have on um, the Silver Jubilee with the mod series. Uh, so anyway Sorry I missed the note. Sounds alright. 